Hi everybody, this is Shalonda Gordon. And I know some people want to do blogs on their blogs. They want like cool signatures, right? And I think on my blog right here, I could show you one. Like there's one signature, my signature right there. And so some people want to know, well, how do you do that? How did you get that there? How did you get that to do that? So I am going to show you guys today how to get that done. You're going to first go to mylivesignature.com. That is going to be at the bottom of this video. So you can go ahead and look there if you need just to click and do it that way. So we are at the home of my live signature. You can go here to free e-signature services and all this other stuff that's here too as well. But we're just going to start here. Click here to start. Okay. So we're going to create a new signature or a font. We want to make sure we get our own signature, what we like, and that kind of thing. So you can use it by using the signature creation wizard. You can draw a signature straight to the screen. You can use a scanned image or create a personal font. Okay, I personally always used the signature creation wizard because that's just easier for me. So here you're going to enter your name that you want your signature to be. So I can say Shalonda. I'm not going to do my middle initial. Gordon. Okay, and then it's going to take you to the next step. So here there are lots of fonts and everything here. You can see different styles that my name is written. There's a cursive. Here's one that's really cool. So that one's kind of cute. I don't like that one. But so there's a few here that you can choose from, right? Now this is just 1 through 10. You can also click 11 through 20. They're going to give me even more. Even more options here. Okay, so you can see you can just continue to kind of look through and see what you like. I kind of like that. It looks like my handwriting when I was little or younger, you know, like in middle school. So I think I'll just choose that one. I like that. Okay. So then you click next. Okay. So now you get to pick the size of your signature. Now I realize it's on your blog. So you might not want it to be like real tiny. You might want to make it a little larger so that it can be seen. Right. So I like size eight because size 10 is kind of big, big, but I like size seven and size eight. I think I'll go with size eight. Yes. And then we'll go to the next step. Okay, now we get to choose our color. What color do we want? Okay, so you can click the change color of the background. Right now it's transparent, but what color do you want the text to be? So we can sit here, we click on click on the box and your color scheme is gonna come up here. I usually have mine um, signatures as green and I like kind of a darker green because mainly because I my blog is green and it just kind of makes sense that all of that is congruent so I do like green if it says if it's not refreshing you just click here and it'll refresh so that's one color green I don't really like that color green though maybe a little darker okay I like that so there you go so now is my colors there that's my signature next step now there's the slope of it. Now my other signature, if you notice, I'll click back to that. You see how it's kind of going up at a slope, a diagonal like that? I think I'm going to go ahead. And have it just straight across. I think I'm going to do like a straight signature this time. Okay, so you have your signature here. If you scroll down, okay, down the page, you're going to see here where it says if you want to use to animate the signature, want to download the signature, want to use this signature. Click on want to use this signature. Okay, click on that and it's going to open you up here. And then here you can see your HTML code or your BB code where you're going to generate an HTML code. Okay, generate that. Shows you how it's going to be. That's how the code's going to look. And then you want to generate a code for my handwritten signature. And so here is your code. So you'll have your code. You can click on here and copy and paste your code. Copy your code. Take your pad, paste it there, and that's going to be your new signature, okay? So you have it there. And there you guys go. That is how you add a signature to your blog. It's very simple, very easy. I hope this was helpful for you. If it was, please leave a um, comment at the bottom. And thanks so much for your time. Again, this is Shalonda Gordon. Have an amazing day and keep smiling.